Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Combat Mission Black Sea. And, uh, the uh, phase line grenade scenario. So, we are the 2nd Striker Cavalry Regiment, operating along the Denapa River, south of the city. Right, so our mission is to clear and hold the town of the nearby bridge, otherwise known as Objective Alpha, across the river as soon as possible. Additionally, there are two forward endpoints that must be secured as well, Objective Bravo and Objective Charlie. Once all three objectives have been secured, the platoon is to go firm and defend against, against any counterattacks. Okay. Tactical map. So you can see here we're going to approach this tree line. There's a road here. The main bridge over here. Uh, it does not look as though that bridge is actually up. That doesn't look like it's um, there, does it? So four points possibly here and here, maybe? I'm not entirely sure. So, we have strikers, good, support available, mortars, howitzers, and a raven USB, USB, UAV. The enemy, 20th motorized infantry rifle brigade equipped with BTR, 82As with the 30mm cannons. Those are bloody impressive. The Apaches reported 5 BTRs confirmed as destroyed and approximately 20 to 30 dismounts KIA. The pilot said they probably killed more. Okay, don't forget about these uh, tandem RPGs. Hmm. No tanks in the area. Right, so there may be some tanks, but we don't know. Plans to... Uh, right. Okay. Right then, uh, so what do we have here? Quite an interesting time of day, possibly night. What options do we have here? What options? Right, so Alt B? Okay. We'll play with Alt B. I know it's quite hard to see on YouTube at times due to how YouTube bloody renders. Right, so we can see the destroyed BTRs here, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's the dead BTR, so I'm guessing. Something else died, perhaps. So we have uh, some information about the troops being in the town. Yeah, it's quite an incredible advantage to have some information already. So what do we have here? We have uh, one striker, two striker, three striker, four. And a Humvee. That's, uh, that's a decent force. Okay, so take a look at the uh, terrain. This would be quite a nice position to have some overwatch on to approach these buildings over here. Approaching these buildings over here, we could get the javelins. No, it wouldn't do. If we were to get the javelins lined up, we'd have to get them in here. That's actually quite a commanding spot for the battlefield. So, we'll call that a priority target. Priority objective. Okay. So we have our javelins over here. So we're going to have those guys acquire another javelin... So you have three, and now you have uh, five. Actually, so you'd have two javelin launchers. Um, I don't know how you put equipment back. I shouldn't have taken a second one. It's not bad, but it's just a little bit dangerous. Considering there's only two guys here, and they both now have javelins, so fair enough. Right, so we'll have the javelin set up over here then, perhaps. Well, what I'll do is I'll probably march them into that tree line, but for now, we'll have them set up and overwatching over there. Get you into a better position, like over there. Okay, so you can watch that area. Right, striker, 50 cal, the grenade launcher, grenade launcher, and a 50 cal. <clears throat> Excuse me. Right. I do like the 50 cals, but they don't have too much penetration. So what I'll probably do is I'll just have two strikers together to work in tandem. A grenade and a 50 cal, so at least we get the best of both worlds. Oops. View viewer here. Open up. Cruise short sight. Oh, it's a good thing. And the Humvee as well. Ah, I can have the Humvee up here. It has the... Uh, does it have a grenade launcher too? Ah, it does. Awesome. That's pretty awesome. 
Well, have you watched that area as well? Okay. Have that striker look that way. Well, then we'll have the infantry dismount and head out into the trees. Could probably do a striker down there, but I could always move in the future. So this requires some equipment. Ooh, a javelin. Yes, thank you very much. Get that javelin. And maybe some extra ammunition, but it doesn't really matter too much. I'm gonna grab another 84. Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Still recovering. Okay, we'll get you out over here. Then we'll have you assault into this tree line. To about there. Then you can, like, look over that way. That's fine by me. Now, you, I think, are going to have all the way over here. There we go. What do we have here? MGs. MGs. Right, fire support team. Wouldn't it be too bad of an idea to have them move up? Yeah. I'll have you look that way, then at least you have some ability to help out. Okay. Grab the javelins. Grab the ATs. Okay, then assault into that position. Ah, oh, right, yes. Hmm, no javelins. That's not good. There we go. And we have a breach team. I'll have you move up over there. Okay. No. UAV. Do we start with a UAV? We do not. Okay, I mean, I could potentially use a mortar to um, attack some of these targets. I mean, I'm probably going to want to bombard this town, but I'd rather know when I'm going to bombard, to be honest. Or at least see something worthwhile. Otherwise, I'm just wasting shots. Right, that should be good. Oh, I like the night vision on. That's pretty cool. Yes, I like that when they do details like that. It's quite nice. Hmm. So, if we can get the fire support team into a position where they can see some of the Russians, then that would be quite helpful. With our infantry pushing up over here. I'll try and make it to these buildings here. If I can get somebody in there, at least we can try and see what's going on. And um, gives us some nice sight over that area and just over this area in general. Not so much over there due to the slope. Okay. Hmm. And what we're going to do here is have them hunt through. Uh, take up a position there, maybe. I don't see any vehicles, so I'm going to have these guys push up as well. I could probably do for having them over here, to be honest, but we'll have to make do for the time being. Okay. Humvee can push up to that position too.
nothing so far. Oh, hello. That's not good. That means something's coming. Oh, hello. Right. Damn good shot. What do we have here? Ah. Right, so we have some entrenched infantry with RPGs. Blow them away. I'll blow that road away. Sure. Yes. Right, we've seen the enemy push up here. That is not good. Not good. Uh, what we'll do then is we'll move our strikers up to this position. Hmm. Or possibly up to here. Depends, really. We'll have you actually push up over this way. You can push up over that way. Have you assaulted those buildings? You, my friends, um, you can quick move here. And then I'll have you watch out that way, so at least we can get another ATGM set up. Have you live that way? Um, I'd like to dismount you, actually. Okay. In fact, I'm going to have you guys quick move over there. <coughs> Excuse me. Have you moved forward a little bit more? There we go. Let's uh, see what the Russians bring us. That was better. Absolutely fantastic weapon for taking out infantry. Ah, oh, there we go. We spotted some more infantry over there. I should probably be using the 50 cals for this sort of work, just because um, there's only so many of these rounds. Right. We'll have you... Um, <coughs> excuse me, my throat is so terrible lately. I'll have you set to anti-armor so you're not wasting all these rounds. Okay. So far, so good. Hmm. I could assault up to this position here, which is probably a good idea. Oh, well, a little bit further up. Ah, uh, then again, might as well go for the building. It's the best cover. Oh, we do have some uh, snipers in here as well. Forgot about these guys. Hmm, trees aren't helping. We'll get you over there, then at least you can have a better line of sight. Hmm. Kinda better. Kind of. Not great, but slightly better. Okay.
be loading. Where are you firing? The 50 cal? Hmm. Yeah, I'd keep your heads down. Oh wow, that's pretty cool detail. So there's a little, um, little bit of fire from where the traces have hit. That's really nice detail, you've got to appreciate that one. Right, so we are pushing up over here. Strikers are something of our anchor point, really. Yeah, keep go, keep. Hopefully that thing's not alive and there's no uh, RPGs hidden there. But we can only hope. I'm just waiting for the moment the uh, BTR decide to make a charge. You know, I had a feeling that was about to happen. I just had an absolute feeling. Yeah, take it out. I was just thinking, uh, yeah, I feel like I've moved too far up. I feel like something's gonna happen, and boom, it happens. Yeah. That was a mistake, ladies and gentlemen. The mistake being that never assume that the enemy, well, never assume a building is clear. I assumed with my infantry being here they would have spotted it, but uh, no such luck. And it is indeed destroyed. God damn it. Hmm. Well, it's a 50 cal version we can make do. But that would have been great to keep alive. But hey ho, I always end up making a mistake and rectifying them. Ah dear. Right, we'll turn you that away. Actually, we don't even need to turn you, so cancel cancel that order. Uh, we'll have you target briefly. Let's get some grenades in there. Okay. Ah. Are they trying to escape out the back? Hmm. There. Oh, he's not gonna make it out here. Come on, guys. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Run the side. Bloody RPG. Ah, I should have seen that come in. I, I was... I was really nervous as it was going to happen, but I'm thinking, oh... They've got so far up, it doesn't seem as though they're going to do anything. But then again, I remember how this game works. They're dicks. They wait until you're very close, and then they do it. They're dicks like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can still do this, fine. Just need to find the enemy. Do we have our UAV actually? We do not. We do not. Um, so, 
my mortars. What should I do with them? I kind of want to bombard this area. Hmm. Come on, kill him. Any time. They have some really shocking aim. Hello. Right, she's been spotted by the infantry over here. Luckily, we have an ATGM. Fantastic. Please kill it. Come on. Come on. When you're ready, sunshine. Great stuff. BTR down. I love the job done so much. Yeah, that could be recovered. I mean, come on. It might be a costly uh, refurbishment job, but I, it, it could be fixed. It could be done. Alright, so I do want to move up into this tree line. But that's good that we uh, took out a BTR. That was very good. So I'm nervous about moving up. Right, what do we have here? Hmm. Yeah, so that could have been quite nasty, actually. So we'll keep our vehicles in reserve until we know what's going on. But that's one BTR down. <coughs> Excuse me. It doesn't even the odds, but it does help. Snipers are moving up there. Hopefully they can try and spot something. M110. Ooh, it's the 50 cal version. Fantastic. That should be really handy. Yeah. Right, they should keep them some fire to keep their heads down. There we go. Alright, come on, snipers. Earn your pay. Have them look that way. Hmm. We'll have you reverse this way, then I'll have you turn around. I could go that way, but I mean, we have seen a BTR over there, so we know there is vehicles in the area. And I'd rather not tempt fate, if I'm honest. Actually, let's change this to a quick order so we can get into that position. And then hopefully just try and set up some fire. Right, move you up. Actually, we'll keep you back here, but at least if something goes bad, we still have you. Okay. Have a Humvee back up. I mean, a Humvee's fine, especially with that weapon upon it. It's just the fact that the um, striker had some armor. Right, they've been spotted. Who have they been spotted by? The infantry and not the snipers. Uh, that's not really the right way to look. Gonna be honest here. Oh well. Ah. 
That's not RPG. It looks like something else. Ah, the ravens are good. Right. I do want to find out about this area, but if I can find out about this area over here. Because I know this most likely BTR now. Actually, if I go for like that, it looks like I'll be able to see if there's any BTRs over there. So we'll confirm that. Yeah, I'll have you move up to that position there so you can support. Good. Okay, we'll have you deploy. Target arc being like that. Hmm, no aim point. Okay, we'll try that. Hopefully once the raven's over we can try and get some um, fire onto those, probably using the Javelin ATGMs if possible. Hmm, I kind of wanted you to be here, but I should have been a bit closer when I made that order. There, there they are. Yep, you see them. Ah. Ah, good, they've set up. At long last. Ah. Spotted by the MG, turn in. Uh, come on, baby, get that fire off. Okay, whatever. Right, how long until the uh, raven comes in? Uh, five minute delivery. We can wait. We have time. Plenty of time. Come on, guys. They're right there. Hmm. So perhaps they're going to need to be turned a little bit more. Perhaps the bipod doesn't work too well like that. Nah, it seems to be a bit weird. Yeah, they're under fire. That's all that counts. To wait on that raven. Okay. Face that way. Hmm. Just kind of expose me to fire. At least then we have the trees to block us off a little bit. It's not fantastic, I agree, but it's better than nothing. There we go. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, well, we got some fire off, that's what I like to see. But alas, we are at the end of the episode, so I thank you all so much for watching. And if you've enjoyed this, you can always go ahead and subscribe, and if you feel uh, like being a generous person, you can always go ahead and um, donate to me on PayPal. The link is on my channel page. So until next time, guys, thank you for watching, and until next time, goodbye for now.